I, Trenton, take you, Alyssa, to be my wedded wife. With deepest joy, I receive you into my life, that together we may be one, as is Christ to his body, the church. So I will be to you a loving and faithful husband. Always I will perform my headship over you, even as Christ does over me, knowing that his lordship is one of the holiest desires for my life. I promise you my deepest love, my fullest devotion, my tenderest care. I promise I will live first unto God rather than others or even you. I promise that I will lead our lives into a life of faith and hope in Jesus Christ. Ever honoring, ever honoring God's guidance by His Spirit through the Word. And so throughout life, no matter what may lie ahead of us, I pledge to you my life as loving and faithful husband. My darling Trent, I stand before you and promise to be your wife. I promise to treasure our marriage, to thank the Lord for you always, to forgive you no matter what, and to encourage you always. I will respect you as the leader of our family, and I promise to pray that you will lead with courage and faith wherever God may lead us. When we walk through the shadows and darkness of this life, I promise to remind you of God's faithfulness and goodness. I promise to always love, help, comfort, and encourage you. I promise to draw closer to the Lord with you so that our marriage may be a testimony of our faith. I take you, Trent, to be my husband and my best friend, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and cherish you always. You look sharp, son. Very nice. Okay. Army doesn't cry. <laughs> you ready? Okay. Trent's a nervous wreck. I'm Kaylin. I'm Alyssa's sister. So uh, I got about halfway through my speech and then I stopped typing. So the ha second half, I'm just going to wing it. Um, Alyssa and I have always been the best of friends. We are some of the closest sisters you will ever meet. I don't know if that was because we shared a room for 14 years or if it's because we were homeschooled um, and forced to spend a lot of time together or because she's just an amazing, caring person. It's it's probably the latter, but um, I am just so thankful I was able to grow up alongside such an amazing sister, Alyssa. 
I am so proud to call you my sister. It has been a joy and an honor to watch you grow through all the different seasons of your life and watching you handle whatever life throws at you like a champ. Like one of her toasting glasses break. She handled that real well. I am so excited because you get to be a wife, mostly for purely selfish reasons, and this is where I get to wing it. I'm just really excited to now kind of share this journey that I have a sister, a confidant to just go to. So we're both married now. How exciting is that? Wow. And Trenton, you're a good guy for her. You really are. I'm so, yes, I'm sure. I'm so thankful that you guys found each other and that you guys found love. And they're able just to grow this relationship into something even more beautiful than it already is. To the Hurt Burgers.
by the authority vested in me and as a minister of the Lord Jesus Christ, I now pronounce, hey, is the barbecue here? <laughs> I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Trent and Alyssa Herberger. She goes.